So currently the world is emitting about 40 billion tons or 40 gigatons of CO2 every year. According to climate science, we need to reduce that essentially to zero by 2050. On the one hand, we have to have drastic emission reductions, which is roughly 90% of the challenge. But we'll always be left with a certain amount of unavoidable emissions. In some recent research, we've looked into about 500 scenarios that keep us below two degrees, as we say we need to do in the Paris Agreement. And almost every one of those scenarios, we need gigatons of carbon removal. If we succeed at everything, if we succeed at efficiency and renewables and nuclear and electric vehicles and buildings and hydrogen, if we succeed at all of that, we will still need 10 gigatons. That's 20%. We do need uh, permanent carbon removal to achieve net zero. And when I mean permanent removal, I mean uh, a solution that permanently store CO2 underground, such as, for instance, direct capture, so anything that Climework is investing on. The advantages of Climeworks direct air capture technology, one is compared to other carbon dioxide removal technologies, it doesn't use arable land, that's important. Second, it uses energy, but that's becoming something that we can access with cheap renewables, so that's becoming really important. And third, the modular design means that it has the possibility to go down the learning curve in the same way that solar and wind. There are technologies that are proven and they're in the field, and Climeworks is probably at the top of that list as far as proving that their technology does what they say it can do. One of the key things to building this new industry and market is trust. At Climeworks, we have established the world's first full chain certification methodology and we are delivering third-party verified carbon dioxide removal. As we look forward and we get into the part where we need removals and we need more removals than was previously projected because we are just so slow with the reduction, we need this tool to become available to us and the only way it becomes available in a material way is if we do the investments behind it now. Most of the carbon removal capacity that will be online and available in 2030 will have been designed by 2025. It's an urgent need because we need to see the demand now for these markets to truly scale and get capital off the sidelines. But when I think about why you might want to get involved, uh, you know, you also consider the fact that this is likely to be a very supply constrained market. And as we move towards 2030 and beyond into lots of commitments coming, coming due for corporations, you're gonna to want to have the highest quality you know, removal technology in your portfolio of carbon credits. And Climeworks is at the top of that, that stack.